everyone. Welcome back to The Restaurant Show. And I have a longtime friend here, uh, Jimmy Lanero from Giuseppe's. And this Giuseppe's of both um, Shelter Cove and Bluffton, mm -hmm. right? And you guys have been around for almost 30 years. This is year 29 for us. Oh uh, my gosh. 30th uh, celebration next year. I mean, it's amazing that they started when you were 10. I know, it's just uh, <laughs> hard to believe. It's very hard, it, it's hard to believe, yeah. Aging I told well. it same. Yes, absolutely. Well, um, and I have already seen some differences in the things that you offer in just what you're showing us today. Tell me about this fantastic place, because I know this is different. You've, you've really done some changes with the menu. For many years, unfortunately, we <laughs> used a frozen product. Right, and, right, right. Uh, Which we, a lot of people do. Well, I mean, that's not uncommon, you know? We made the effort this year right. to go through every item on the menu. Yes. And uh, try to upgrade wherever we could. Absolutely. And we're now offering a, yes. um, a locally grown, homemade, hand-breaded fried zucchini. Okay, I have to taste it while you're telling Please us about do. it. And let me just show them what this looks like here. It's a very simple, very simple process. It's just an e equal combination of uh, Italian breadcrumbs and panko breadcrumbs, a little right. bit of salt and pepper. And and I love the panko because it really adds, it really does add a little bit extra crunch. It does. Than the regular, like, um, you know, it, the regular breadcrumbs. It holds up breadcrumb. well with the panko. And then we yeah. top it off with the dusting of fresh Parmesan cheese. And of course, serve it with my favorite. Our famous homemade ranch dressing. Yes, I dip everything in when I go. <laughs> Oh, pizza in the ranch? Oh, well, yeah, of course I will. <laughs> but let me cut this in, because I want to show you here. I love how thin it is. It must, it's just nice and crunchy and nice long strips. I mean, it really probably takes on that crunchiness and dips into that ranch dressing perfectly. So many perfectly. times you're, you're so used to seeing the fried zucchini that resembles a, a 50 cent piece and we thought we, we'd do the long strips instead and I it fries up it. so nice. I love it, it's so good. Okay, great appetizer, but now, and of course, I mean, your pizza's, I think people have seen my Facebook. I posted the big unit because you <laughs> they, how big is it again? 26 inches. 26 inches. My family is not shy. We've actually taken pictures and posted on Facebook and people are like, okay, enough already. We get it. You eat at Giuseppe's all the time. <laughs> it takes two people to carry it it's, out. Oh yeah, and we've taken pictures of that too. But um, so of course you're known for the pasta and the fantastic pizza. But now this is a new addition. So I'm gonna move this over. And this is one of your new additions, right? We thought we would get in on the burger craze. Yeah, uh, absolutely. Burgers are hot, and yeah. uh, we thought it would make sense to uh, add a burger component to the yeah. menu. And uh, in the past, we've carried one burger. But again, this is an area where we decided to upgrade, and oh, we're yeah. offering uh, uh, just Can a I much. Cut into this? Absolutely. Which one a, is this one now? That is our stock cheeseburger. Oh my gosh! Look and, at uh, that. We, it we is just so went delicious. to uh, went to a much uh, higher quality. Handcrafted uh, Yeah, handcrafted. Patty. That's handcrafted the key. Patty. All right, so let's open up these little treats. I want to see what they brought me. <laughs> I was so excited. We're going to put these on there, and of course, we're going to eat them later. So we carry not four that much later. <laughs> on the menu, and I, I did bring three with me. Yeah. Um, oh my gosh, look at that one. This is the mushroom onion Swiss burger. Shut the front door right now, Jimmy. Give, mm. give that here. Cheese is good. Oh my gosh. I'll let you do the honors. Look at that. Look at the cheese. It's just like. Now, obviously, this is um, gooey cheese. Is gooey beauty. cheese, especially at Giuseppe's, because I feel like whenever I eat the pizza, the cheese is just like so delicious. I mean, look I have to make a that. correction. This is our barbecue oh, bacon this, Swiss burger. You know what? Let barbecue me show bacon that. Burger. That's the barbecue bacon. Oh, look at that! You can see the oh my god, the barbecue just oozing out of there, and the cheddar and the bacon. Applewood okay. smoked bacon. Beautiful. Okay, now this one. Can I cut this one in half? Go right now? ahead. Oh my gosh, Jimmy! I mean, look at that. I would be like this. I'm the girl that takes it off the paper. Mmm, yeah, it's, it's delicious. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna cut that up. Now, what's on this one again? Uh, two patties, Swiss cheese. Do they uh, all come two patties, or is it just one patty? They are two patty, the, the smash burger prepared on the flat top Absolutely. griddle. Absolutely. Oh my gosh, look at this. Great flavor. Look at that. Grilled onion, grilled mushroom, Swiss cheese, Good. nice soft bun. Yes, that is a um, two-hander for sure. I mean, I've got one, but when I'm getting into it, I'll. <laughs> all right, so we're gonna. I'm gonna put this over here. Okay, we got one. You guys, and the bun is so soft, and it just combines into that bread. Per, I mean, the burger perfectly. And mm. this is the this is the stock cheeseburger. That now I this is the mentioned this earlier. Is, okay, this is a stock cheeseburger. This is your good old cheeseburger that you can get if you don't want all the bells and whistles. Because there's a lot of people that they just want to get a good old cheeseburger. Uh, out of the three burgers, uh, the four burgers on the menu, this yeah. is still the best seller. Oh, again? Just a plain classic cheeseburger. You know what I'm gonna do there. I love it. Cheddar cheese, mm -hmm. tomato, lettuce. Onions. Absolutely. 
And do they always come as a double, right? Yes. Okay, perfect. We do right. offer a single for a kid's burger. Okay, and this comes with um, lettuce, tomato, onion, onion, and mayo. Oh, it doesn't get better than that. That looks good. And do you serve this at lunch? And look all day. at that. It's available all day. Mm mm. Now that is my kind of burger. I'd ask for extra mayo too. I'm not shy. <laughs> all right, so we do these every day, lunch and dinner. Um, and there's four. what burger are we missing? We make a, a cheeseburger sub that's basically a, a sub sandwich version of the stock cheeseburger. Of burger. the stock cheeseburger. Mm -hmm. Okay, so if you want to go for a sub, because you guys have fantastic subs there. We use a nice Saloni's oh, Italian yeah. roll from Pittsburgh, uh, our hometown, and uh, absolutely wonderful bread. And you guys bring that in special. I know that you guys went to great lengths to get a special bread like that in. Very happy to have it yeah, on board. Yeah, absolutely. So now tell me um, one other thing. I know I've heard that you guys are going to be, you have that great farmer's market around the corner and you might be doing some items there. What are you going to be doing over there? Farmer's Market started last week and it's from 9 to 1 every Wednesday. And where is it located? It's in the Shelter Cove Community Park, which is oh, okay. uh, directly behind the plaza at Shelter Cove. Okay. And uh, right That's new though. There. Has it always been there? Last week it started for the very first so time. That's, so that's different, you guys. That's not, that's not one that's been there. So if you haven't heard of it, it's because it really is brand new. The Farmer's Market behind Giuseppe's. And what are you going to be doing there? Well, we plan on going over there every Wednesday. Okay. And uh, gathering up whatever produce we can. Mm -hmm. uh, probably zucchini of and uh, anything else we can come across that we can uh, use in possibly pasta yeah, and or pizza specials and we'll call it farmer market farmers market Wednesdays. I love it. I love it. And really just incorporating yourself. And you guys have been part of the community for such a long time. And I probably know about eight to ten people that are probably in their thirties that have all worked for you. I mean like they've been around for a long time. So please check out their new items on the menu. Um, check them out at Farmers Market. I mean you guys are really branching out. I'm really excited for you. We, you could follow us on Facebook to find out what specials we will be running. There you go. Absolutely. Thank you so much Jimmy. Thanks I can't for having wait me to have you on again. Thank you. Maybe we'll bring that big unit. <laughs> I know I can't get over it. <laughs> Thank you so much you guys and we will be back in just a moment.